we are really excited about this new feature we've been working on at Realty Candy, and it's our single property websites. So you would want to come here to idxaddons.com, um, log in, and you would want to go to websites, to this website section here. And here's where we have our single property websites. Creating a single property website is one of the best ways to make your listings stand out online. It provides a very detailed web page where you can showcase everything about that specific property. Um, also, since the single property websites have their own URL, that will help you improve your exposure and ranking on SEO. So let me just show you really quickly how easy they are to set up. Um, so click here on single property websites. So you would want to go here where it says create websites. And you're going to have your featured listings here. So um, it's important for you to have featured listings in order to be able to create a single property website. Let's go ahead and just choose one um, so I can show you how this works. I'm going to be choosing this one right here. You're going to click on that one and you are going to have to confirm that you're authorized to um, display this property as a single property website. So you click here and then you click on create a website. It's going to start to create the website. It's going to take a couple of seconds. There you go. There you have it. And just like that, you have um, your single property website of that featured listing. Um, so before I show you how the final website looks like, um, there's a couple of things that you can modify here. So I want to go over that first. Um, the first thing you would want to activate is the SSL certificate and also the logo. Um, you are going to be able to place the image URL here, or you can also upload the image um, through your files. Then you have this notification section. Um, this is for you to enter your email and phone number um, to get the notifications from people who sign up on your website because there's this contact form that I'm going to be showing you right now. And then also um, there is a space for you to place custom code in case you want that for the header and the footer. Um, so for example, I'm gonna show you right now the website. This is how it looks like. This is what was created just by clicking on create website. And as you can see right now, the site is not secure because we have not activated the SSL certificate that I mentioned to you previously. Um, so let's go ahead and activate that. As soon as it's activated, it's going to take a couple of minutes for it to um, actually activate that. We've refreshed the page and now um, the certificate is there. Connection is secure. This is how um, the actual website looks like. You're going to have the sections over here to go through the page. Um, this is the property name. So this is the address and the value. And then if you click on about, it's going to scroll you over to where the about of the property is located. So you're going to have the whole text over here. Um, what type of property is it? The price, a number of bathrooms and bedrooms as well. Um, if we keep scrolling down, you're going to have a schedule tour here and a contact us that will direct you to the contact form that we have further on the page. Um, next would be the features of the property, what interior features it has, the location, additional information, and the financial information. And then um, pictures, you can just scroll down or you can just click on these little menu bars that we have on the site. Um, and it will take you directly to that section. Um, these are the pictures of the property and you're going to have a view all pictures over here. Um, you can click on that and scroll through the pictures of the property like that as well. And then we have the location, uh, which is the map of where the, the address, this is coming from Google, where it's located. So then finally, we have the contact us form um, for your users to get in touch with you. And if you've registered your phone number in email, on the previous sections that I mentioned to you, you would get notified that way of people that sign up on your website. And they're also gonna have a schedule tour option right here where they can select date and time um, for a tour. And then um, if we keep on scrolling, 
if you have other single property websites that you've created using like the same method, um, they're going to show here. So this is another one for this client. If you click here, it's going to take you to that other single property website. And then in the future, if you decide you do not want to have um, the single property website active, um, you can go back to the dashboard and we have an archive website button. Just click on that, um, click archive, and it's going to save it that way. If I refresh this, it's going to say website deactivated. The website has been archived and is no longer available. Um, and then if you want to activate it again, there is this button for you to be able to unarchive the website. Um, and if we refresh, there you go, you have the website again. So as you can see, setting up single property websites is very simple um, and they're free to all of our Realty Candy clients. So if you already have an IDX broker account but are not part of the Realty Candy family yet, um, you can go over to idxaddons.com slash free and just click on one of the email providers below.